so the ultimate goal is to get out to this tiny little beach or this tiny little sandbar that's right next to Inclot State Park, which actually you can get to the state park. It's also away from the actual landmass of Florida. Um, and you can actually take a ferry to there, but they have a lighthouse and all that kind of stuff. So we're gonna try to check that out, try to put the drone up, see what we get. Um, and basically we're gonna try to launch from Sunset Beach, but I don't know if there's an actual launch there, so we're gonna find out. Busy like most people are, we have so little time, a budget, and have big dreams to travel and explore. By taking adventures in Orlando, our hometown, and traveling the world, we plan on making those dreams a reality. To see what's next, subscribe and welcome to our journey. You never know where we might end up. So in our last video, we were on the west coast of Florida and we checked out the Clearwater area. We checked out Dune Din and our honeymoon island and Dog Beach. Um, and we actually launched our jet skis from Jet Ski Beach right there off of the Dune Din Causeway. And now we're headed up to Tarpon Springs, Florida, which is only a couple miles past uh, Clearwater, basically. Alright, there's the launch! <laughs> uh, so we just got the skis out in the water and then we realized on the sign it says that we need a permit to actually come here to Sunset Beach and launch and park so uh, technically you're gonna need a a city pass from Tarpon Springs so we're gonna see if we have a ticket on our windshield when we come back so word to the wise if you're coming out here you need a permit to park in the actual little tiny area of Sunset Beach but this is a cool spot. The launch is perfect and we're literally, as you can tell, on the ocean. <laughs> so, And it's super, super calm today. So we'll see how the end of our day goes when we come back. <laughs> it's uh, high tide right now. The tide's going out. Low tide's at 8.30 in the morning. Wow, okay. So this is high tide and it's super shallow. <laughs> So that is one thing when you're coming out here to Sunset Beach and you're going to the uh, nature preserve, the island that's across the way. It's super shallow and you're gonna find manatees, you're gonna find turtles, but obviously just be super, super careful when you're coming through here. So now we're making our way to Anklo or Alicot. I cannot remember how to say it, but that's where we're headed now. There's the sandbar. I'm sure you can probably see the group of boats. Okay, so while Nate is over there, he's literally, he's over there with the GoPro. So, yeah. I literally missed out on seeing this freaking guy. I was so bummed. Oh, and to top it off, Nate not only saw this guy, but he actually saw a second one, which he said that one was quite a bit bigger and it had spots. Uh, yeah, sadly this is a reality most of the time when I'm off trying to capture something else. But hey, it wasn't a total waste I suppose. And at least I got a few good drone shots.
spot. They got coolers and stuff there. So this is Ancloth. And it looks like it's a couple miles long. I'll find out the specifics on it, but I don't know. <laughs> so Nate forgot his SPF shirt and he forgot to put SPF on before we left. And I, of course, forgot to grab the SPF to bring it with us in the backpack. So he's literally getting fried right now. So I think we're gonna have to bypass the island for right now. We'll definitely come back and show you guys what it's about, but I don't want him to be a, a fried lobster. <laughs> so we're headed back to the ramp now. But luckily for you guys, one of our loyal subscribers, and he's another YouTuber, he actually had some aerial footage of Enclote Key. Thanks, Jason. guys enjoyed our video give us a big thumbs up it actually really helps and if you're new here don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below smash that bell click all and then you'll be notified when we go on our next adventure see you guys later